Hey everyone, and welcome back. Now we're talking about, uh, I just covered the DLC that has been confirmed for Mass Effect 3. Now quickly, that DLC, as far as I read, that it will, no, it will not contain any new gameplay. It will just uh, add on to the cinematics and uh, the cutscene sequences to uh, better clarify the endings uh, to the people who are were dissatisfied with the original endings. Now, they did state that they are, uh, they are proud of their... Uh, design team's artistic uh, take on the endings, that they're happy with the endings, but for anyone who wasn't totally, uh, or couldn't understand the endings, or, you know, it wasn't clear to them, uh, they would clarify it with add-ons to the, uh, cutscenes, and, uh, you know, just the ending cutscenes, there would be no gameplay. Now we're talking about, um, if, uh, uh th if they plan this ahead of time. Now there's an article I'll I'll put it into the description, but uh, there's an article saying that um, as you guys know, uh, there was a DLC that you had to pay for upon release, which is from Ashes, which gave you a new character from which is a Prothean, and you guys um, obviously know what a Prothean is if you play Mass Effect One, Two, and Three. But uh, I felt like that was a rip off. Uh, it, it provided some you know cutscenes, some dialogue, some back history, which was. Nice for a really big Mass Effect nerd, which is me. I love Mass Effect. I think it's an amazing trilogy. You know, other games should look up to it. See what they can take from that as w as uh, storytelling goes. And they did improve on the action as the games progressed. But uh, do you think this was planned by uh, Bioware beforehand to uh, rip people off and gain more money? No, this article kind of go to explain to it. I wouldn't put it past them. You know, Bioware is great. Let me get that out. Bioware is great. But what they did with uh, From Ashes DLC, I, I wouldn't put it past them. Now, uh, I just want to know what you guys think. Uh, do you guys think this was all planned out uh, to get you guys confused on the ending so uh, they could release DLC and make an extra you know, profit off it? Or do you think uh, generally um, this is something that they want to fix with the community and that they really do care about? Um, I, I, I know Bioware does uh, do usually uh, produces decent DLC and they do care about their community and they do listen to their community but what they pulled with From Ashes uh, it just seemed kind of a rip off I did buy it because I was really interested in the Prothean background you've heard so much about them in 1 and 2 and it's just I'm a Mass Effect geek you know nerdgasm guys <laughs> oh god but no seriously um uh, I just want to know what you guys think do you guys think Bioware planned this out ahead of time or uh, do you think that uh, they're actually listening to the community and they do want to fix this? They want to make it right. Uh, let me know in the comments uh, or send me a message. And please subscribe, guys. I'll be updating more as uh, information comes out about the Mass Effect DLC. See you guys in the next video.